Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about The Flash Season 7. So this is something that I do every single year, as we normally head towards Comic-Con. So, this is heading towards DC Fandom instead. It should be happening in just about a month from now. There's going to be panels for all the DC TV shows, so that's The Flash, Supergirl, Batwoman, Legends, like, the whole lot, like, every DC TV show you can think of is going to be at DC Fandom. So we're going to be talking about what to expect from that trailer that we are hopefully going to get at DC Fandom. And I'm going to explain why we could get a trailer and why we're maybe not going to get a trailer in today's video. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. Alright, so yeah, like I said, this is a thing I always do heading up towards Comic Con every year for Supergirl and The Flash. So this is a what to expect video, what to expect in The Flash's new trailer, so in this case it's about Season 7 of The Flash. So the only reason why we can talk about there potentially being a trailer at DC Fandom for The Flash is due to the fact that they filmed their episode 1 already. They filmed it pre-lockdown, pre-corona, and they had all the footage in the can, they nearly finished episode 20 of season 6, which would have been the third to last episode of the season. Instead, they are planning on retooling the episode into episode 1 for the season. Obviously, they're not going to release it until January of next year. It's going to be a long time until we get that actual episode, but they can release a trailer, or I really hope they can release a trailer for The Flash Season 7 with their use of the footage that they've shot for the original episode 20 of season 6. So I'm hoping this is happening at DC Fandom because in a press release that they released when they first announced DC Fandom, in it they mentioned that some of these panels will be showing exclusive footage and trailers and I'm holding out hope that The Flash and potentially Supergirl, there's going to be a Supergirl video like this out in a few days time as well, will release trailers because they actually have footage that they didn't use. It's not the same case with Batwoman because yeah they have more footage but they're recasting Batwoman, they've got a new Batwoman completely like a whole new character so no way Batwoman can do that unless they cut around Batwoman and you know don't show Kate Kane. So that's different for The Flash. We had them shooting episode 20, they finished about 90% of the episode and the only difference is they're going to have to take out Ralph's scenes, they're going to have to take out all the Hartley Sawyer scenes because he's been fired from the Flash, they are 100% not going to use any of those scenes in the trailer so don't expect any Hartley or Ralph in the trailer but I'm talking mainly to do with the whole episode like they're going to cut that out of the episode but in regards to the trailer we're going to find out a bit more to do with where Iris is. Eric Wallace, the showrunner of The Flash, has teased that that is going to be a big thing in this episode. There's going to be some twists regarding where Iris is and what she is doing and, you know, her specific circumstances. Because if you remember at the end of last season and the end of season 6, episode 19, we had Iris and she sort of fragmented into these shards and she just disappeared somewhere in the mirror of us. And it was just after he was talking to Camilla and they were about to go rescue Sing in the mirror of us, or like normal Sing in the mirror of us. And then she just kind of fragmented and disappeared. So this episode is supposedly going to be big on Iris. And in regards to the episode, not specifically the trailer, but maybe we'll get a glimpse in the trailer. There is going to be a big guest star returning from the earlier season. So someone, and I have no idea who it is, but someone is going to be returning in The Flash Season 7, Episode 1, because they were supposed to come into Episode 20. Off the top of my head, I don't remember any rumours or hearing anything about a big guest star coming into Episode 20, but as far as I know, it's a big Iris episode, lots of Mirrorverse, and Team Flash are going to be trying to get Iris out and get Camilla and get Singh, because they know they're stuck in there now. And that is going to be this episode. It's going to be Iris in the Mirrorverse. There's going to be some twists about where specifically Iris is and what she's going to be doing. But at the same time, we've got Team Flash trying to break into the Mirrorverse somehow. And, you know, trying to save Iris, Camilla and Singh. And I'm presuming Cisco's going to be back this episode because the episode before episode 19, which was in the end the finale, you had Cisco going away. He said he had to go to Atlantis to get this thing. 
that would in the end help them defeat Eva. I'm guessing Cisco's going to be back unless, you know, they wait till 21, which will be episode 2 of season 7 and Cisco will return. However, you know, this big guest star could be anyone, but all Eric has said is they're going to be specifically from earlier on in the series. Okay, so, you know, that's the main bit about the episode. That's the main story. You've got the Iris and Team Flash stuff going on. Also, they've teased that this episode is going to be very emotional. It's going to be potentially tear-jerking and it's going to be potentially like a, a big moment. So, I'm guessing potentially Iris gets out of the Mirrorverse. They're going to be fine. Maybe there's a casualty along the way or something like that. However, it's not the finale, so... I don't know, maybe they will save that for episode 3 of this season, which is said to be a two-part finale, we'll talk about that in just a minute, but it's said to be very emotional, so I'm guessing Iris gets back to the real world, and Barry reunites with Iris, and those two have some sort of chat, they're going to have an emotional chat of sorts, and this is going to be the big moment where they're like, holy shit, it's been so long, and I'm so sorry I never noticed that I was with this fake Iris this whole time and I never realized and you know apparently there's going to be some relationship kind of strains after this after Iris finally comes back so yeah there's going to be a story wrap up with Eva in that two part finale as they have teased and that's going to be episode two and three that is going to be after this episode and they haven't shot anything from two and three which was originally going to be episode 21 and 22 of season six so when we get the trailer we're gonna see nothing from that it's gonna be episode one footage mainly to do with virus I'm presuming there's gonna be some team flash stuff if they do cut together a trailer and like all past Comic Con trailers which are normally teasers but you know they have a decent amount of footage they reuse footage from the past I'm presuming there'll be some stuff from last season's finale so episode 19 probably some stuff to do with how the episode ended and then where they are currently in 20 which will be episode 1 by this point but in regards to what we know about what was going to be episode 20 not just specifically the trailer that could potentially be coming out of DC fandom is that apparently there was a pretty big chunk of the episode where Ralph was in it like apparently according to what I've heard and this is just rumors it may be wrong maybe that it's true and they had a bunch of footage with Ralph and Hartley and obviously that's all going to be scrapped and they're going to have to refilm retool the episode in a way that makes sense to move on to episode two and three which they haven't shot and you know basically they can reevaluate you know the start of the season with what would have been the finale and final few episodes so all we know going into the final two episodes is it would have been a two part finale and there was going to be a reverse flash cliffhanger at the end of episode 22 which will now be episode 3 so from that we can presume that reverse flash is probably going to show up some point this season I don't know if they're gonna go with a cliffhanger now that it's been spoiled and now that episode 3 is not going to be like some sort of big finale it's gonna be a big episode because they're gonna defeat Eva in episode 3 but it's going to be just an episode before episode 4 and then it would be like just a normal episode basically in the middle of the start of the season so you know it's not gonna be such a big thing but I'm guessing reverse flash is gonna show up at some point and I'm really hoping they stick to their original plan and they actually go for that reverse flash moment that will lead forward to more reverse flash stuff later in the season so yeah that's about it for this video guys thank you guys so much for watching thank you for the support recently keep on watching these videos as they come out I'm trying to put out as much content as possible I've got a few videos planned for the next few days and I am currently catching up on Stargirl to be able to put out videos before the end of Stargirl Season 1 so Stargirl videos will hopefully return very soon. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you guys later. Goodbye. I see red.